Good morning, everyone. Uh, this is English Foundation Course 1. Today we are going to be talking about different types of vocab. And we will also connect accuracy, grammar components, lexical elements, and semantics with it. And this is called Lexical Semantics, according to Foundation Course 1. And we are just talking about uh, one of the best grammar books in the whole world. Oxford Guide to English Grammar by John Eastwood and from there I just collected these uh, elements. First one is metonym, with different types of uh, lexical semantics I'm talking about. First one is metonym. Metonym means part for the whole. When you just describe one thing for the whole thing, suppose crown is referring back to the king, the whole kingdom as well. This is one of the examples given. And retronym is it's referring back to the past incidents and where two words when you use right now it will be redundant. Suppose that time in the past silent movie was applicable. But right now if you just give silent movies people will laugh at it because there is no silent movie uh, available right now. Only movie is there. And you can also blend two copies words together like uh, fantastic and interesting, fantastic, which to be very exceptional and people will just a kind of shocking view on it. Next one is heteronym, the third one. Heteronym is a kind of variety. As you can see, pronunciation will be different, meaning will be different, only spelling will be the same one. I give the example, dove is a bird, the dove is a dove in the river, past form of dive. Fourth one is homophone, it, as, is, as the word itself suggests, phone means pronunciation. So pronunciation will be same, meaning will be different and spelling will be different. I knew you, I knew you. The presentation was very new. I knew you. The presentation was very new. So pronunciation is very close, same almost, but spelling is different and meaning is different. Homo name. Homo name is referring to the different meaning. Spelling will be same, pronunciation will be same. So that is very confusing for sure. Watch. I watch my watch to watch. The house. I watch my watch to watch the house. Three words, totally meaning is different. All the spelling is same. Pronunciation is same. I watch my watch to watch my home. Another example is there. I saw a saw to saw a tree. I saw a saw to saw a tree. Three different saw meaning is totally different. So don't lie, please lie down while it shocks it. Lie, lie. Synonyms are uh, similar meaningful words. Terrific, wonderful. And antonym, opposite meaningful words. Terrible. What is the opposite of terrible? Terrific. Definitely. Opposite meaningful words. And hyponym, the last word. Hyponym means general idea for specific contents. Suppose human referring to men and women. But this another example I gave. Chairman, chairwoman, chairperson. Simple. So hopefully I've understood this lexical elements perfectly and I believe that it will remain in your permanent memory and you will not get confused and this is gonna be very good. Thank you very much.